Beekman Elementary School, it's time for another episode of the Beekman Bears Friday Funorama. Let's get started. So, let's... Whoa! What? What's going on here? This is weird. Who are you? I'm uh, Mr. Lapvis. Then, who am I? Well, you're Mr. Kimbark. Really? Yeah, today's twin day. We're twins. Hmm. Oh, I guess we are. Same tie, same shirt, same yeah. mask. Yeah. Wow. Um, okay. Uh, how long does this last? Well, probably just for today, because tomorrow is, is Friday. It's sports day. Hmm. Okay. Hmm, makes sense. Carry on, Mr. Lapis. All right. On Monday, our school is going to be celebrating Autism Awareness Day by wearing blue to bring attention to Autism Spectrum Disorder. Mrs. Dara and some well-known Beekman Bears like Nicole and Ben will be organizing activities and sharing thoughts on the morning announcements. Thank you to them for bringing attention to autism. Let's all wear blue on Monday. Luca Yacovone participated in the April STEM Challenge. Way to go, Luca! He came up with a really creative way to protect an egg from a fall. He used a spaghetti squash. Check out these pictures of Luca's experiment. So Thursday, April 22nd, that was Earth Day. And our Girl Scouts from uh, Beekman, um, they planted a small spruce tree um, near the garden. So I want to thank our Girl Scouts for taking the time on Earth Day to do this little project and to uh, give back to the school. Um, so thank you to these Girl Scouts, Olivia Tavares, Nicole O'Connor, Claire Geiger, Cassidy Sudlow, Gia Cointreau, Chloe Colucci, Natalie Tavares, Hadley Scuchamara, Samantha Morales, Brianna Chafin, Isabel Sarnasoff, and Vera Schwarz. So take a look at some of these pictures of the Girl Scouts planting the tree by the garden. And thanks again. And this whole week was Spirit Week. Um, we got a few pictures, not a ton, but we got a few pictures of uh, students on Twin Day and then also from uh, today uh, with uh, Sports or Activities Day. So check out these pictures of all the Beekman Bears uh, enjoying Spirit Week and showing off their school spirit.
right, so we have two guests on today's Friday Funorama episode. Please welcome Journey and Toby to the show. Hey guys, how you doing? So what brings you here today? Well, we want to tell everybody at the school about duck doodles. Duck doodles? What's that? Duck doodles are fun little creations. Take a look. Huh. Look at that. That's cool. It's like a little duck face. So what's this for? They're just for fun. We want to spread some silliness and joy around the school. And duck doodles seem to make people happy. Yeah, and we want to give them away to Beekman Berry. We will have them in the main lobby for students to take one. Please, only take one, though. We need to trust Beekman Berry to accept, accept responsibility and be respectful for others so there's enough to go around. Well, yeah, that's important, right? We want to make sure everybody gets one. So I think it's a great idea. And the world can definitely use more fun, laughter, and silliness. Thanks for doing this for the school. You're welcome. And here's your own special duck doodle, Mr. Lapis. Whoa! This is awesome! Look at that, everybody! That's a big duck doodle. And its mouth works, too. That's great. Thanks. Duck doodles, duck, duck doodles. Not a poodle or a yummy noodle. Get your duck doodles today! All right, I think you know what time it is. That's right, time for another Joke Friday. So I had a few of my Beekman Bear friends come down, and uh, they're going to help us out with Joke Friday. So sit back and enjoy these jokes. Why was it so hot in the baseball stadium after the game ended? Why? Because all the fans left. Oh. <laughs> where did the ants go when it gets hot outside? I don't know where. To Antarctica. Up <laughs> not. Who's there? K. K who? Is it all okay if I see another not not joke? Knock <laughs> knock. Who's there? Ron. Ron who? You can run, but you can't hide. <laughs> Doink. What did the orange say to the banana when they were looking for the apple? I don't know what they say. Keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> Doink. What's the worst type of jam? I don't know. A traffic jam. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all for today in this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, have a wonderful weekend. Uh, but before you go, make sure you check out this picture from Mr. Cointreau. Um, he took the picture this week as he was driving by our school. So thank you, Mr. Cointreau, for seeing this wonderful picture of this rainbow over our school um, and for thinking to send it to me. And now we get to share it with the whole Beekman community. So uh, thanks again, everyone. Take care.